and indeed that is uh, forming uh, let's take a look at just some of those issues that we are discussing today indeed the media council of kenya had that meeting with the parliamentary committee on energy information and communications to raise just some of those contentious issues and here now is a look at just what those issues are and what the media wants indeed terming this kicker bill as draconian and they are clear on what they don't want so let's take a look at some of those contentious issues uh, the media has raised issues with the multimedia tribunal to begin with and the media has been very clear on what they feel this tribunal should be handling and they have said very clearly that this should not be handling issues to do with the ethical conduct of journalists but instead should stick to matters of media infrastructure and taking a look at signal distribution and those are the matters that they want and we'll just move uh, to the next one now just so that you can take a look at some of those issues they have also raised issues of course with the constitution of that multimedia tribunal who gets to appoint the members of this taking issue with the fact that this should be done by the cabinet secretary or by the president citing interference from the government and also of course talking about the fact that uh, this multimedia tribunal might include members of uh, who are not part of the media fraternity such as the Kenya National Union of Teachers and in so doing might compromise the work of the media let's take a look at another issue that the media has raised regarding discipline issues and this is of course is where we talk about the issues of fines now by now you know that the meet that media bill proposes 20 million shilling fine for a media house that speaks out of turn and 500,000 shillings for a journalist who goes against that conduct what does the media have against this simply the fact that it is unsustainable and also of course due to the fact that the fines um, have not been issued based on specific issues that a journalist may have contravened and i believe they managed to reach some consensus on this in that meeting today let's finally take a look at another another contentious issue and this would be the role of the bill the memorandum that was sent by the president back to parliament regarding this bill actually talks about the fact that the Kenya Editors Guild and the Kenya Union of Journalists should not be a part of that selection panel now this is where the issue of contention is and of course stating that they should be part and parcel of that selection panel to make sure that they understand the issues to do with the media now the council wants the bill to only deal with issues of infrastructure like we talked about before licensing signal distribution courier services and telecoms these are some of the issues that um, the media council has uh, against the kicker bill and like we said a discussion was had between the two of them and we understand there is some consensus that has been reached on this issue and so we're hoping to see how this one plays out because this committee will then be tabling this on the floor of the house and it'll then be debated only then will we know whether uh, which way this will go and also just a reminder for you for more on these issues Jamla Kamau who's the chair of that commission together with David Ohito who's the deputy chair of the Kenya Editors Guild will be live tomorrow on Morning Express with Sophia Wanuna. You do not want to miss that discussion to get some clarity on these issues.